cooking up this bad boy today, whole, raw, pasture-raised, organic chicken. Gonna make a homemade bone broth loaded with collagen, so good for the gut, and I wanted to reply to some of the comments that were made. Be sure to go in and watch that tip number 193 on homemade collagen bone broth soup and read some of those comments. Okay, so first thing, a lot of people that I work with have food issues or eating disorders. They wouldn't want to touch this, but they will be much more likely to touch a rotisserie chicken. That is one reason why I always encourage people to use the rotisserie. Also, people are on the go. It's a little bit easier. You can have that rotisserie for dinner that night and have the soup for tomorrow. Cha-ching! And three, because why would we waste it? That rotisserie chicken makes a amazing broth. Actually, it has better flavor and it's just as good. Some recipes actually call to roast your chicken or your bones before you make your stock. This is from the recipe from the Sally Fallon Nourishing Tradition Cookbook and it says there are lots of different ways to make bone broth and there really isn't a wrong way. I love that. 15 years ago, I was super sick. Using healing staple foods like bone broth and Fermented foods changed my life. Cook smart, guys. Being healthy doesn't have to be that hard. Like and follow for more.